Yeah, my name is Jeff Kloon. I am a research team leader at OpenAI. To quote uh, Wayne Gretzky, the greatest of all time, skate to where the puck is going, not where it is now. Ken Stanley. And Charles Darwin. Evolutionary biology. Yes, I was in San Francisco and I read about Hod Lipson's Gollum project where they 3D printed robots after having them automatically designed in computer simulations. Substantial promise on AI generating algorithms. I'll take two. One is there's been an increase in diversity and inclusion, although we have a long, long way to go. And the second one is we're starting to see active misuse of AI, such as deep fakes and the Chinese suppression of the Uyghurs. All of them. I think it's too hard to pick. Many. Uh, Rob Pennock, Rich Lensky, and Charles Ofria, Hod Lipson, my postdoc advisor, Ken Stanley, uh, Zubin Garamani, John Lawson, Diane Grunert, and Susan Mundy. Limited compute. We think we have a lot now, but we're going to need a lot more. Yes, with some uncertainty. Billion parameter models. Uh, Vancouver. Charles Darwin in The Scientist and the Ideas, Rich Lensky and Ken Stanley. I'll go with two, Learning to Reinforcement Learn by Jane Wen et al. and also the Hypergradient paper. Twitter. Jeff Hinton, Yashua Bengio, Zubin Garamani, Ken Stanley. Interesting question. I think the AI is here to stay because it's useful and companies will take advantage of it. So in that sense, there won't be a winner. But there will be times when the hype and expectations outstrip the current capabilities. And so the hype will fade while in the background it's continuing to be used at an ever-increasing pace. Uh, on Twitter, I'm at Jeff Kloon and also at jeffkloon.com. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff. All right. Thank you. So